Hello everyone, Shrimp Tails here, and today we're doing a fall for McDorfer in the world of Fallout New Vegas. That's right, Axe Man. It's time to get shanked. Ooh. Classic Switchblade with mods by Listener. This is a replacer for all of the Switchblades in the game, and they all look fantastic. This includes the unique Switchblade Thorn, along with other Switchblades, and you've got a whole bunch of different handles, um, improved Switchblades, and just a ton of just variety and this definitely allows you to play around with these switchblades and possibly use them as a main weapon so we're gonna be using this i'm gonna be using most of these but uh axeman might might grab one of these and uh do some stabbing too plasma submachine gun by side effects this is two beautiful plasma submachine guns as you can see here just very lovely uh, one of them's got that little thing going on in the front very nice very cool you can mod these if you want with uh, laser rcw recyclers or for the Plasma SMG, you can use a Magnetic Accelerator as well. Really nice design, can't wait to get these out in the field. Like Clockwork Inspired Armor by Eric Fishy 3000 This is inspired by the Queens of Stone Age video, Like Clockwork. And as you can see here, ooh, four wonderful costumes to dress up for Halloween. Or just for this episode. It, it could be both. I could be both. I don't know. But yes, very cool outfits. Some of these are just the outfit. Others are, you know, the mask part. So I uh, gave uh, Axeman one of the outfits, the body part, and I've got one on as well. Very cool, very fun. And last but not least, we are doing The Big Rescue by the one, the only, Jokerine. That's right, everyone. We got another Jokerine quest mod, and it is October, so we got Spookatron. Ooh, Spookatron, what you get? Get get spooky. That's right, everyone. It's Halloween. I put some bats on Spookatron, but I guess those bats disappeared. Where'd them bats fly to? Where'd your bats go? Alright, whatever. So yes, we are doing a Jokerine mod today. Um, apparently, on the way to Jacobstown, there's a man crying his brains out, and we're here to wipe those tears away and shank his enemies. So, come on. Anyone want to come shanking? I'm going to start banking. In my shank clothing. Look at look look at this beautiful smile I've got on. And anyone who walks up to me knows I'm a smiley guy. And I'm gonna take them tears away, make you start smiling. You just gotta find them. So they said on the way to Jacobstown. So uh, keep your eyes peeled. And looks like we found him. Hey, Marek, what's the matter, buddy? You! Please help me. I don't know who else to turn to. Okay, alright. Surprised to see a kid out here all alone. You got a little collar on there. What's going on? Tell me what's wrong, little baby. What's going on? I'm looking for someone to help. Will you? Can you spare a minute? Do you have a demon inside you, little boy? Oh, goodness. Uh, tell me what's wrong. There is... this place. Really close by. Me and my crew have been stuck there for a very, very long time. I just escaped. Things are dreadful over there. Bad. Sad. And they took my puppy. What? I need my puppy. Yes. It's very urgent. It must be suffering horribly. Go get that puppy. Will you spare my puppy this awful fate? Please say yes. I may even be able to pay you back. Maybe. Of course, Emmerich. How'd you escape? To be honest, it wasn't particularly difficult. The warden is always alert. Well, almost always. See, both Adalbert and Severt are quite vain. So while they were primping in front of the mirror, I snuck out. Adel Maybe not the most exciting prison break story to tell, but that is how I got out. The warden to... must be much more alert now. More than ever. Must know I'm coming back for my puppy. I'm coming back for my puppy. Your cruise, you say? Yes, you know, my friends. We all ended up in that place together. I want to help them escape too, but they know my puppy comes first. <laughs> uh, who took your puppy away exactly? Warden Adelbert. Nasty, nasty piece of work. That's all I'll say. He doesn't run the place though. That is Severt's role. They're both awful in any case. Um, got it. Uh, tell me more at the place. The Blatsky Heights. It's horrible. Cold and damp. Really dark inside. 
Used to be an upscale lodge, I believe, but now... It's like a prison. I mean, I have been in much worse places. Me and my crew get around. But it's no good. You'll see. The only good thing are the daily specials from the food dispenser. Thaco Thursdays. Hey, if you find the recipe, would you mind picking it up? I'll get you some Thaco Thursdays. Uh, let's get that puppy. I'm certain it will not be a problem for you. The warden may be keeping an eye out for me, but I don't think you'll raise suspicion. So, here's the plan. I'll mark the location on your map, just up the hill, go in, and get my puppy out. That's the goal, you hear. Nothing else. Once you have the puppy, come meet me at Jacobstown. I'll be waiting for you there. We'll go over the second part of the plan then. Oh, God. Good luck, and thanks again. All right, well, ever since uh, Giddy Up Buttercup, I don't know how I feel about what's about to happen. Make your way inside Voblatsky Heights Lodge near Jacobstown. Kid, you gotta run. You can't just sit over here. That's where you escape from, kid. Come on, jeez, we do it. All right, so... Typical Al fashion. I went to Jacobstown and climbed over the mountain. There's a path directly here. Ugh, I just I drank some... Drank, drank some gross juice. Ugh, ugh. Took a little break, took a juice break. Now I feel gross. Hazardous cliff. Many dogs have died here. Put your dog back in the vehicle. Oh, and he's all the dogs. Doggy treat. Oh, pork chops grave. Cotton's grave. Stop jump jumping. Pretzel and scamp. Man, there's some great names. Boblatsky Heights. Welcome to Boblatsky Heights Lodge. Please state the purpose of your visit. I'm here to throw my dog off the cliff. I'm here to rescue a stolen puppy. Um, I have a package to hand in. Yeah, mumble something vague. Get out of my way, stupid trash can. I have business here. Mumble something vague. What was that? Are you here to deliver supplies? Last week's supplies have not arrived yet. If so, please go in and talk to Sievert. Thank you. Yep, that's it. Oh, boom. I am the most... I am such a stealthy baby. Ooh, caution, cliff top, watch step. Yeah, that's a fall, all right. That's a fall, for all right, and them uh, big horns over there. All right, we gotta get a shovel. <gasps> oh! <gasps> the scenic telescope offers a close view of these gorgeous surroundings for a great price. Accepting caps, pre war money, and zero dollar legion. Uh, two caps. Oh my god, it's beautiful. Look at Vegas. Oh, look at the unbelievable. Oh, man. Welcome to Vegas. Welcome to Vegas. It's low polygon. Doo -doo. That's awesome. I really enjoy that. It's the little things. Well, well, well. Look who finally got here. This is my uh, compatriot. Uh, he helps me deliver packages. Ooh, wishing well? Can I make a well wish? Can I wish... Wish, wish, wishbone. I just want to explore, make sure there's not anything we're missing, because I'm sure there will be. There's a chair. Bed. Oh! Yes. Ooh, it's a half dumpster. I want one of them half dumpsters. Shh! Spookatron, you're way too big. We could try and, can you analyze the roof area? No? Okay. Yeah, I didn't think you could either because you've never done that before. Alright, well, let's go back down. Man, Spooktron, we gotta make you smaller or something. There we go, now you little spookies. Who's a little spooky? You are. Alright, let's go inside and rescue a puppy or something. Ooh, more robots. Oh, and dead roaches. Alright. We gotta look at everything. Oh! Oh! Oh my god, it's a little... Oh my god. Oh, it's so furry. Look at his little furry face. Mmm. 
Oh, Goldie, we're gonna steal you. We're gonna take you here. Hey, look. All right, so the robots have gone sightseeing, so they're not like... You're looking great today. Oh, thank you. I think it's my mask. Man, this is creepy. Butterball, the little chick. Ooh! Like stealing. Butterball, the little chick. Speech increased by four. Cheap, cheap, you can now talk to birds. Tate for tots, order 4561. As per your request, here is the receipt for your purchase. Order 4561, comprising of one crate of our special sorted entertainment hour surprise boxes. Please kindly remember that we cannot guarantee the content in the box, but rest assured that it will have plenty to keep the ankle biters in use for a long time to come. Your total is 3,000 caps, 429... Ooh, 3,000, four, oh god. In addition to the fee for your special speedy delivery service, your package should arrive tomorrow. Thank you for shopping at Tate for Tots. We hope the little ones have fun. Subscription. Hi, unit blah blah blah. Thank you for your subscription to the Homemakers Guild uh, newsletter. You will receive all the latest news, child rearing tips, and fun gossip from THMG, including special discount coupons for selected stores and more, delivered weekly to your inbox, just like magic. <gasps> We're very glad that you're interested in our updates. Interesting. I can't read. Welcome to the group and let us know if there's anything that we can help you with. The Homemakers Guild. Notice, your mailbox has exceeded the strong limit. Uh, please ac activate your account within 24 hours or your account will be temporarily blocked. Very much so. Here, make wiener bigger fast. <laughs> your advice, fall instructions. All right, tater tots. Assorted Entertainment Hour. Alright, we're here to deliver the Assorted Entertainment Hour. Let's see if we can talk to this bird now. Alright. Whoa, look at this! We all killed Grandma? <laughs> what? <laughs> I love the clutter. Oh, God. I am death. Too early, join me. Breath mouch, foul air, drink alcoholic liquors. Okay, eat midnight suppers. Okay, e eat lots of rich food. Mm-hmm. Bolt your food or wash down with large amounts of black coffee. Eee, neglect bowels. Yeah, I guess so. I mean, I poop. Monday, bows a drink. Apple. What's today? Saturday. Casador egg mash. Ooh. Would you get Saturday fair? Chunky Napolito. Mmm. Oh, look at all the bald kids. Hey, bald kids, you like Agent 47? Is that what's going on in here? That's what's going on. It's Agent 47. Okay. Hey, Agent 47, you kids want some food? What's going on? Where's this puppy? I'm here to rescue a puppy. Is it a fake puppy? Is it a dead puppy? Oh, did you eat the puppy? Oh, they ate the puppy. Get ready, everyone. They ate the puppy. Oh, dear. Let you in. I am not ready for visitors. I need to dress up. Could you sit here and wait for a moment? I shall return promptly. Sure, whatever. Hey, kids. The child's eyes seems to be saying something. Arsenio Hall. Wilhelm scream. Stop using your eyes to talk to me and use your mouth. Unless you're all mutes or something. Uh-oh, drop the salad. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, dro drop the coffee. Uh-oh, drop the beans. Hey, man, you ready? You finished in there? Oh. Okay. All right, you stay here. You stay here. Shut up. Don't make any sudden moves. Well, I want to sit next to the little chicken in. One hour later. Holy crap, yes! This is the best day of my life. <laughs> we have been eagerly expecting these supplies, especially the right away. Please give them to me. Oh man, yeah, about that. What were you doing that took this long? Wow, this place is dumb. You took Emmerich's puppy, didn't you? I'm here to rectify the situation. What were you doing that took this long? I put on my robe and wizard hat. <laughs> Uh, about that. Oh, you do not have the supplies. I must have misunderstood your intent. So, why exactly are you here then? Come on, man. I sat here for an hour. This place is a dump. Do you really think so? I would assume it is better than sleeping outside in the cold snow. Perhaps I am wrong. 
I mean, no, you're right. You took Emmerich's puppy. I didn't want to reveal this to you, but I'm here to rectify that situation. I should have assumed he would send someone over to try and collect it. I understand. Did he mention anything else, by any chance, about me? He said you were me. If I had to guess, he said this place is terrible, and I stole his puppy to try and get you on the sign. He could be quite manipulative. I am afraid nothing could be further from the truth. No one could ever trick me like that, never. What are you talking about? So you didn't take the puppy? I could just knock you out and take the thing back. You didn't take the puppy? I could take it, but I did not steal it. Before I explain the situation, however, perhaps you could do me a favor. Tip for tat, as he might say. Well, man, peach and water supplies the well outside. Teen. The water we get is usually clean. Lately, however, the water comes out irradiated. I am not waterproof, unfortunately, and I am afraid of sending the children down. My partner went down there to investigate and does not return. All you need to do is enter and figure out what is wrong. It should not take you more than two minutes. Would you be willing to do it? Two minutes? Jeez, man. I'm not getting any younger. Why can't everything be- why can't anything ever be easy? You said your partner went down there? Can't you send in the warden to check? Why would you care that much about the water? How could I not care? Irradiated water intake is likely to cause major health issues for the children. Such as massive organ failure. Yeah, what are these kids doing here? Can you tell me? I mean, I guess you can. Um, you said your partner went down there. Can't you send in the warden? You are correct about my partner going inside. I am quite agitated. Yet, the safety and care of the children comes first. And, as Albert is currently away on the daily sustenance purchase trip, that leaves only you to assist me. Oh, did he leave? With your help, I may be able to find out what happened to my partner while I keep the children in check. I am very fortunate, indeed. Alright, why can't anything ever be easy? Life is a negotiation. We all want. We all get to get what we want. This is true. Alright. I am glad to hear that. Let us go outside and I shall clear the entrance for you. Please come with me. Is it open? Did you open it, bud? Here we are. Something appears to be lurking beneath. The entrance has been locked as a precaution. Please climb in and find out what the problem is. Where did War Warden uh, Adelbert go? I don't see him anywhere. My internal tracker tells me he is currently meeting with a trading caravan. This is the way you get supplies, you see. The children need food. Uh, anything I should know before I dive in? According to my records, the cave below is quite small. I do not think it is completely flooded. No artificial life sources have been installed yet. Any idea what could be uh, lurking beneath? Based on the evidence available, I think it is safe to assume it is some sort of radioactive creature. Okay, so anything. It could be literally anything, Sievert. Sievert, you're a robot, come on! Narrow it down! I may find your partner down there if they haven't escaped already. Um, wait. Partner? Wouldn't, th wouldn't, it, wouldn't that be a robot? It is a possibility. I do not think it is possible to exit the cave through any other openings except for this one, however. So escape is unlikely. All right. Maybe that maybe it is a person. Maybe the person got lost in there like 80 years ago, and now this guy's trying to get us to find him. Uh, you better be straight up with me here now, dog. Of course. After your safe return, I shall hand over the puppy, as promised. Is the puppy gonna be like dead or something? All right. Of course. I must go prepare the children's next meal. They should not be left unattended. I shall lock the door while I am busy. A lesson learned. I will be away from the well, so the best way to proceed is for you to set off one of my partner's noisemakers with his lighter. You may borrow it. You might be able to find a noisemaker down there. Even when dead, they are quite strong, so I will easily hear the noise from the building. Good luck. And thanks for all the fish. Alright, door's locked. Let me check. Let's check this now. Just want a do blade check. Nope. Okay. Oh, I fell. I pooped my pants. Oh, such is life. That's why you always carry a bunch of extras in the back of the car. Well dug out. All right. And he gave us a little, uh, what did he give us? Something to make noise? We'll figure it out. Whatever. I'll figure it out. 
Get over, get over here. What are you doing? Oh, no. Oh, wait a minute. Are you... Wow, that is really going to hurt me. Oh, my God. That's awesome. Are you going to... I mean, you're going to attack me, but... I'd rather you don't. My switchblade probably can't handle this. Oh, God. Holy crap. Oh, God. I'm gonna die. Oh. Axe Man's freaking out. Oh, good, good, good. Protectron head. The disembodied, reinforced head of a factory Protectron seems to stare deep into your soul. Upon closer inspection, appears some data left on the robot's central processor may still be salvageable. What would you like to do? Download that data. Doop, doop, the booba doops. Noisemaker pouch. Threat has not been dealt with. You are still being shot at. <laughs> Shooter! Shooter! I'm gonna kill you with an axe. <laughs> Shooter! Casador Egg Mash. Well, I'm. Ooh, we got a custom icon too. That's great. It's the best day of my life. Stop doing your Jesus shtick. Did you kill... Okay, good. You didn't kill Spookatron. There are no ghouls down here. Stop doing your goofy... Time to get shanked. Don't get shanked. There we go. Look at those baby legs. Look at these legs. Oh, we gotta have a robot ghoul. In a... This bag is slightly damp, but with a good spark, it should go off with quite a rumble. The entrance is opening. Everything's okay. I don't know if I should have done that. Do, 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 day. Oh man, now I feel bad. His little robot bud's dead. This is the worst day ever. Ooh. Hello there. Well, thank you very much for this early Christmas present. Guess what? I am pleased to see you alive. The children are fed, and I have an extra serving for you. Ooh. You may take it. Thanks. Now, please tell me what happened. All right, there's a bunch of mole rats. There's a ghoul with robot legs. I don't know how he put your friend's body on, but that was gross. There was a ghoul in armor down there, a glowing one. Thank you very much for your help solving this issue. I sincerely hope it was not too much of a bother. It's nothing, Seabird. I'm just surprised at the ghoul being armored. Know anything about that? My general database is not had any relevant information. However, I dare say the instinct of self-preservation and protection still lingers. A uh, detached factory protectron ahead with some leftover data was half buried. Cave was already that I thought my teeth were falling out. Um, you mind if I pop in down there now and then? Are you interested in bathing? Perhaps. <laughs> if so, it is no problem. However, clean after yourself. That is the water we use for cooking, after all. Alright, so don't poop in it. Gotcha. Um... Detached factory. I am afraid those must be the last comments of my partner, Selena. Please do not request any more information on this topic at the current time. Thank you. Oh, man, that's... Now I want to ask about it. Cave was irradiated. So it seems. As a token of my appreciation, please take this. Hopefully it will make you feel better. Right away? Ooh, boy, thanks. Wouldn't mind getting some more of those noisemakers or some assembly instructions. I do have a few that you may take. 
for assembly instructions. However, I will need to search my data banks. Please ask again later. Did you just give give me a ro ooh? Got rid of that ghoul, bat that guy, bat, bat that puppy. Yes, of course. I know that is the main reason you are here. I appreciate the help you have given us, that is for sure. We did have a deal. Or, a deal <laughs> in the parts of our times. So, the puppy is here, and its controller is here. Tell America I said hello. Thank you very much again. Now, kindly remove yourself from the premises, as they are no longer public property. Goodbye. Oh, it's a little... Oh, my God. Oh. Oh, oh my God. It's amazing. Oh, it's the best day of my life. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, what did you give me? I forgot. Oh, I, I wasn't paying attention. Noisemaker. What? Are these grenades? Oh, look at that. Oh, my God. Robotic puppy's bone. Summon robotic puppy. Okay. Mmm. Mmm, little puppy. Bok bok. It's the bok bok. Mmm. Alright, so we can go down there and take a bath. I can't go back here. Okay, alright, little pups. We'll get you back to your, your master. Don't worry, little pup pups. Alright, little pup pups. Don't worry, little bud. I don't know if the little pup pups is gonna fall. What's he jumping at? What are you doing, little pop pops? I see you jump jumps. Okay, little pop pops, come on, let's go. Little pop pops gonna come with us. Oh, we see little pop pops. Forget about the children. Who cares about them? Those kids, they don't know anything about anything. Did he not even get to Jacobstown yet? Come on, kid. Get to Jacobstown. Rent a room. Hang up some pictures. Personalize your space. What are you doing? God. Oh, Jesus. How did you. Wait. Oh my god, you changed so much. I'm being... I'm being wandoozled over here. Ain't that right, robotic puppy? You and me, we gotta, we gotta live our lives together. Exactly. There you are. What took you this long? Okay, so you are an assassin. Huh? Who are you? Whoa, take a look at yourself. You aren't much to look at either. Hey, screw you, man. <laughs> Who are you? Who I am is not important. But I am here... And so are you. I'm a man of many names. But you, my friend, may call me Dodo. Oh, I get it. Dodo. Like a sniper. Okay. I'm supposed to meet someone else here. I got this puppy. Gray-eyed kid, I presume. Yeah, he was here a short while ago. Took off in a hurry. But told me the plan. Left something for you, too. First off, is the, uh, the puppy with you? Yes. I see it there. Good. Good. Maybe you're not as dumb as you look, amazingly enough. Oh, oh, what did you, oh, what did you, oh, man. What do you know about Emmerich? He is Emmerich, you idiot. God, why am I so stupid? What do you know about Emmerich? I don't know much, but he's paying me a pretty penny to babysit you around. So it's all good with me, as long as you keep yourself in check. Mm-mm, I'm not gonna do that. I'm gonna be like a Disney movie. I was wondering if you know anything about this puppy. Can't say I do. But hey, it is kind of cute, isn't it? Worth ransacking some robots home, no doubt about that. Yeah, you're right. Uh, Emmerich left something for me, you said? Uh, why should I trust you? You look shady. Emmerich left something? That he did. I'll give it to you momentarily. Just need to go through the plan first. This plan? Why should I trust you? I have no idea who you are. You look like the kid. You're about the same height. We're on the same payroll here. While you wandered the lands, I studied the blade. Well, it's rolled together civilly, and no one's gonna lose any limbs. What does that even mean? Are you a ninja? I mean, you're assassin. A shady assassin. Well, I should kind of hope so, shouldn't I? I mean, you realize I got kind of a theme going on here? Jeez. Look, man, you gotta blend in. You got an eye patch and a mask on? That's not blending in. Just dress like some rocks, maybe put a beard on or something. I don't know, man. Got the puppy here. What now? All right, then. Junior mentioned that we should go back to the robot's lodge and sneak into the second floor to grab a golden skull there. Apparently, the guard robot is out on errands, and the other one should be... sleeping. Recharging. You know what I mean. Should be easy. Make sure to put on this thing. Sort of earpiece the kid made for us. I got my own here. Let's head back and we'll see how we can get in. Please, my friend, lead the way. I'm at your service, or whatever. 
Oh, nice. You got an earpiece. Oh my god, look at that earpiece. <laughs> what would you like to do? Equip headset and summon Dodo. Okay. What is it? Oh, this is going to be awesome. Why do you think Emmerich left like that? He was quite eager. I don't know. Jeez, um, it's not like I have a hotline to the boy's mind. <laughs> He's just dumb. In any case, whatever happens next, we'll manage. Mind running me through the plan again? Go back to the lodge and get into the second floor to pick up a golden skull. Not that hard to remember. I don't know, man. I don't know. It could be real difficult. Can't say I saw any ladders or anything while I was inside. Yeah, I saw them on the outside, dum dum. I'm sure there'll be something outside then. The boy wouldn't give us an impossible task. Although, with kids, you can never know. Right, exactly. I mean, the parent trap? Obvious example. Warden was gone when I left, but he may have returned by now, or not. I know that. We'll see. I believe he's supposed to keep the baddies at bay, so stay alert. We might find trouble there. Uh, your pieces look pretty shoddy, but they work. Don't blame me. I think the youngster made them. The fact they even work surprises me, you know. Yeah, that's true. I resent the fact I got no choice in this matter. Oh, cry me a river. You can waste time when you're dead. When I'm in heaven with the dolphins. Can you tell me about yourself? What? No. We got stuff to do here. Maybe we'll talk if you buy me a beer later, if you're that desperate to know. Oh, yeah. That's nothing. Let's keep moving. <laughs> Humph. All right, are you going to follow me? Oh, wait, wait, is the puppy? Oh, my God, the puppy's going to follow you. Oh, my God, best day of my life. All right. Axeman, Spookatron, you guys got this. This is your house, right? That's very true. Spookatron, you're not a real companion, so, uh, taking away your ability to move. Whoa, 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 whoa. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, you get back here, Gecko Jesus. Man, you were fighting a lot of... Why were there... Why were there feral... <laughs> why were there... Bark, bark, bark. <laughs> um, yeah, yeah, okay. Oh my god, I love that puppy. It's the best thing ever. Oof. You make one Fallout 4 quest mod with a, with a robot puppy or a talking potato or any goofy item, you, you've won my heart. Here we go. Trap door. This is our way in. Hey, I went there before. It wasn't open. It doesn't work. Doesn't work, Dodo. You fool. You idiot. Ready to continue? Yeah, yeah. Seems like the warden isn't back yet. Wow, quite the view from up here. What's now's? Okay, words. Agreed. But don't get distracted. Stay focused. Too late. I'm already hard. Uh, seems like the warden isn't back yet. I'd call it beginner's luck, but I'm not a beginner. In any case, we shouldn't overstay our welcome. Let's get on with this. I'm an intermediate. Trapdoor, huh? Fair enough. Don't know what else I expected. Uh, crashing through a window, perhaps. Come on, we're not savages. Oh, that'd be awesome, though. All right, let's go. All right. So, trap door. I'm thinking you'll go in, and I'll stay up here to keep an eye out for the warden. I'll deal with him if he shows up. Oh, man. The youngster said the puppy is very important, so it should be safe out here with me. Getting the golden skull shouldn't take more than a minute. Chop, chop, then. No time to waste. I want to go home. Hey, man, you got... You are the kid. Why do I have to go in? Can't you go inside? Getting the stupid skull will be much easier than dealing with the warden. Consider it me watching out for you. I do enjoy stealthing around and all, but I just want some fresh air, you know? Alright, I can appreciate that. Anything you can tell me about the room going in? Not really. Junior said it's mostly old dusty stuff. You can take some if you want, I guess. Except for the golden skull, of course. That's his. Obviously. You know, I could take the puppy and keep... It's safe, too. Hey, you got to hang out with it earlier. Now it's my turn. All right, that's true. It's a very cute puppy. All right, leave me hanging here, and I swear. Chill, friend. No need to worry. I'll be here. Dodo, I love you. You and me best friends, 2017. Good luck. Don't forget your earpiece so we can be in touch. All right, got it. Look at my face. Look like an idiot. <laughs> All right, little Pop Pops. You, you hang out with your best friend. Oh, he doesn't love me. <laughs> I'm going to shake everyone. Shanks for tears. Oh my god. Oh my god. This is amazing. Glad I didn't bring anyone with me. Life. Man's journey to the moon. Radio times. Autumn news. Bird bird. Cheep cheep. Oh look. All oh, the clipboards have a new texture. I don't know if I did that or the mod did it. A marble sphinx. 
ancient queen bust? Oh, look, that's my brother. You don't know what my brother looks like. Aged cellist? Dusty pan flute? Bunch of nerd stuff in- Hey, what's taking you so long? Hey, man. Just got here. This isn't a museum visit or whatever. Hurry up. Shut up, man. I'm looking through things. Antique box. Ooh. Got some birds. Some tables. Ooh, a witch. A little Halloween going on. Little bottles. Oh, my God. We're taking the hippo figurine. And the boat. I don't care. I like figurines. Oh, parrots. 